And welcome back to my YouTube. Here's another image in which I want to let you know. It's, I call it the 101 lot of words. And it is in the Medeon. It is something in which I'm uncertain of, obviously. A lot of stuff I'm uncertain of, especially with this. Uh, it looks like it was signed by his... Uh, Possibly the his co-workers, his pupils, his friends, uh, his love loved ones, um, and uh, possibly um, him himself um, uh, prior to his death and after his death. And what uh, this is is a, about the size of your thumb out of 719 photo shots. This also happens to be the me Dion woman that is the more mature uh, Mona Lisa being serenaded by an extremely handsome man. This is part of some of the green and it has um, his uh, notes within it. Uh, very tiny. And uh, within that it also has hidden little codes that's a little person with another person and it coming across on a T and if you actually look at the uh, following of what is not written it comes out to be like a peace sign coming on down with an I and an I and a nose which is another symbol of uh, the meaning of what they're meaning and when you even turn it, I'm sure it changes dramatically. And in one of these writings I have written somewhere, it said, uh, to my uh, uh, wife. And one also, it was on December 25th, said, no ring. And I really thought that was super sad because no ring on Christmas. And... Um, must have been pretty devastated, pretty hurt, but he did get his ring. I know that. I've seen it somewhere. I, it's easy to lose, and, and it was many, many, many years ago. I have a general thought. Look at the way he does his words, okay? He does his words, and that's a face, okay? In many different ways. He, he's, he's a player, see? Here's a face. Here's another face. Here's another face. These, they're making faces in these words. So, I don't know how to try to get it to be any more what um, uh, understandable because I really don't understand it myself. But if you turn it, It looks kind of like a Christmas tree type deal, which he's done that. And then if you turn it again, the words start to come out even different, obviously. But you can see how he has his code. It's like a four and a two with an upside down seven. Uh, he's got everything within it. It's almost Japanese Chinese writing. And I believe that he probably did a lot, a lot of studying with the Chinese because he did uh, Chinese silk art that's within his paintings. So if you look here, here's an eye and a face with two dotted deals. Um, so I don't know what to try to tell you except for what I see out of it is something that I would love to to know what it really means and uh, I'm getting close uh, that I'm sure um, like again here's the five I'm gonna start writing down what the five really means and that means I would have to go you know okay um, this is an S with a line but then is it also the seven so I, it would t probably take me to decipher uh, this one, this one, this one that is looks like blank, but it is something because you can see within it. 
and 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 this one to probably do that probably take me half a day uh, but you guys also understand it may just between this just this word right here may be a whole paragraph because within these particular images of each one is a letter and a sign building a bear with a bear nose and um, within this is an M on the bear and then this right here is a V and then this within here is uh, also a upside down L or a seven and it goes endless so he and then he has the bear so do you integrate the bear with the L M seven O uh, and then he prolongs it he connects it and you see he connects it so did he was he going across here and decide to go like uh, Spanish do with an upside down question mark to let you know that there's a uh, uh, um, question at, uh, in the beginning of the question or in Americans they put the question mark only at the end and then um, sometimes you have to read the paragraph two or three times to understand that oh I didn't know it was going to be a question I kind of like the way the Spanish people do it because they're letting you know beforehand to think about what you're reading and apparently he was not only thinking about what he was reading or putting down he also made sure that it would have been extremely difficult except for the ones he loved to understand what he meant by them so this is a, a very interesting um, photo of just one of 719 photo shots of this particular area this and everything in which I have done for seven years I hadn't even done the back so I have a, a lot to look forward to and so do you God bless the whole world the universe and the heavens and don't forget to say your prayers amen and thumbs up please